So my name is Angie Reisky, and I've been with the company for 26 years. So I don't know how much time we have to talk today, but I have basically held almost every title in the company. Um, I started out as Craig McElhenney's personal assistant, who is the owner of our company, and um, have held many different hats. Right now, so out of all the titles that I've had, um, working with Craig as his personal assistant over all these years, he found my niche for me. Um, I'm still a senior project coordinator and that's what I love doing. So I kind of put off to the side all the other um, positions that I held because we grew so rapidly that it was hard to multi-juggle so many different positions. Eventually, what I do at the end of a project is audit the final project before it's turned in for invoicing uh, to our accounting department, making sure that all of the costs are accurate, the invoicing comments are correct for our customer, and making it seem seamless behind the scenes. We do all the free auditing um, and just making sure that our customers are satisfied with the experience that they've had with our projects. As a sales coordinator, I always reference it this way, that we're the nucleus of the customer experience. So we take the project from the beginning. Once it becomes a project, it's, it's quoted by the salesperson. And then once it becomes a project, we take over from there. So we order all the material. We do all the customer service to make sure that it's kind of like an Amazon experience. And that's how I've always tried to do all of my service to our longstanding customers is that when you place an Amazon order, you say, hey, I got your order, thank you. And then the next process is your order's ready to ship and then it's going to ship and then it's in, you know, it's in process. So it'll be here on this day. So it's a continual communication with the customer, customer to make sure that they know what's happening with their order through the life cycle. Um, and they love that. They, they like knowing exactly, I mean, they might not always respond to what, what we're communicating to them, but it's always a finger on the pulse of every phase of the cycle. Um, we make sure that the coordinators um, make sure that the material is ordered correctly and all the colors are right uh, on the orders and just make sure that it's a, a seamless process. Okay, so as a sales coordinator, being the nucleus of, of a life cycle of a project, we interact with every division within our company. We communicate with our warehouse team. We make sure that they have the right ship dates and the right material ordered, and they know how many trucks we need on certain days. Um, we also communicate very closely with our in installation team. So, we find out all the details for when the install is going to happen, who's going to be on site, what time they're going to be there, how many trucks we're going to have for that day. So that communication with the installer is critical. If we don't have the right material on, the, on day one of an installation, you can have people dead in the water, which costs our, our, our company time and money, and it's just not a good experience for the customer. We also do project launches for our customers so that we flesh out exactly all the details of what they can expect with the experience that's gonna be coming forth with their project, who's coming, what time they're gonna be on site. Um, along with that, we deal with our vendors, the partners that we have outside of Storage Solutions. We have developed many relationships with several vendors like Nashville Wire and Speed Rack Products Group where they are our partners and they are part of the coordination cycle as well with our customers to make sure that we have everything that we need from day one on the start of the installation. We also are involved with our accounting team. We audit that project so that everything, all the costs are analyzed and detailed out before we turn that in for the customer to receive an invoice.
Um, Craig McElhenney and Dick McElhenney were the beginning of this company. They founded this company on honesty and an integrity. And I feel for me, I want to carry that tradition on. Even though we've grown into this huge company, the relationships that we have with our customers, with our vendors and people internally, this is my family. I've been here this long because I love what I do. And Craig, who is the owner, I was his personal assistant for many years before he retired. He used to say, you know, Ange, you have to love what you do and do what you love. And that's why I've been here this long. I continue to enjoy what I do, servicing our customers. We have so many repeat customers and that's because of the people. It's because of the experience that we provide them. It's seamless and we make it look easy. There might be days when it's really tough behind the scenes, but to the customer and the experience, it's a piece of cake. And that's why I'm here is because of the people.